So something pretty cool happened to me today to the whole five people that watch these. Um, a friend of mine um, linked me on Instagram the uh, author Jackson Ford has seen my um, the girl who could move shit with her mind is neoliberal garbage uh, video and uh, actually was pretty cool about it. I had a good sense of humour um, called me a conspiracy theorist which for Rob I keep meaning to call him Rob Ford who was the crack smoking mayor of Toronto um, but that would be incorrect because he died several years ago and obviously Jackson Ford isn't. It's just it's just the first thing that comes to my head when I hear Ford. Although funnily enough, Rob Rob is Jackson Ford's real name and uh, for a journalist I think he'd understand that calling someone a weird conspiracy theorist <laughs> could be libel. I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> I'm a law student and it could be considered live, but it's it's not. It's just a bit of fun. Um, and I'm actually really stoked that he saw it. I'm happy that he had a good sense of humour about it. Um, I'm just in from work. I'm going to feed my monstrous fish. Um, yeah, he, he's got a really good sense of humour and genuine thank you because it was... I recorded it months ago when I was really unwell and it's done more than half which is really nice obviously it's all disliked because it's all from his fans but that's uh it's funny because he's got a good sense of humor but they they're pissed off um or they're having a great time um just dunking i guess like one thing that i'm amazed at is how many people are like 20 minutes as if close reading can't be close on any any work um Something I loved was the amount of, like, fi fiction in podcasts or something. Um, I'm just going to check. Real. Jackson Ford. Here we go. Okay, so this is what I'm from. <laughs> this is what Jackson posted. Um, didn't link me, which is fine, I guess. Um, but he called me a weird conspiracy theorist. Um, I guess I'm more bored about that than I thought I would. But this is cool. Brittany Young is awesome. Brittany Young is in Glow, which is one of the few not shitty Netflix shows. Um, congratulations. I will give you a trophy that says neoliberal garbage. I think we can make it. Me and you, Jackson, we can make it. And then this thing. I'll, I'll, make, I'll make you a trophy. That says neoliberal garbage. Um, what have we got? Free advertising. It is. I mean, that's a little bit uncalled for. I'm a tiny, tiny channel. You are New York Times bestselling offer. What's going on? 24 minutes. That amazes me because it's close reading. And I like to think that I gave Jackson the respect to actually read into his work and find something there that maybe even he doesn't know. Um, he doesn't like Firefly? No, I don't like Firefly. Fictitious Pod. That weirds me out because they are, according to... Fictitious YouTube. Critical analysis and close reading is part of storytelling and understanding of storytelling. Um, at least how many layers? There are, there are many layers. Basically, this can come off as two ways that uh, I'm really pissed off, but I'm not. I'm genuinely happy. I'm stoked um, that he <laughs> he found it. Like that's really funny to me as well. That um, Jackson found this review because he either somebody like posted it to him and sent it to him, or he was having a diva moment and looking up his own reviews. But either way, thank you for the shout out, and uh, I look forward to the next book. I hope it's great. I. I earnestly hope everything I read is really great but the girl that could move shit with her mind just didn't work for me and I found too many things on it which were a little um just not to my taste and close reading didn't didn't appeal to me although it's kind of funny that that video is now the most interacted with and it's only got dislikes on it which is kind of cool because I talk about a lot of like um 
social injustices, so it looks like they're all disagreeing with me on it. <laughs> Thank you, Jackson Ford, so, so much. Um, hit me up again if you want that neoliberal garbage trophy. Tiny little coda. Um, this is the only comment on my video, and it's new, so it's clearly from... It's not from Jackson, I wouldn't say someone did that, but one of Jackson's fans who's went out of his way to save them, although four more of his fans have came to agree with him. Terrible review, LMA, oh, you missed the entire point. I think I thought more about the point than anyone else on the planet has, and also it was the girl who could move shit with her mind, not fucking gravity's rainbow.